Hello and welcome to the 2021 Virtual Leadership Recognition Ceremony. My name is Steve Rossi and I'm the Director of Student Engagement and Retention at Middlesex Community College. We're sad we're not able to celebrate in person this year, but we hope that this virtual version helps to showcase all the incredible student leaders we have from across the college. From our clubs and orgs, to our leadership and honor societies, to our distinguished student leader awards, we have a lot to showcase. So let's jump in. I'd like to introduce our Associate Vice President for Student Affairs and our Dean of Students, Pam Flaherty, to bring her greetings. Hey MCC students, quick shout out to say thank you and congratulations. It was a really interesting year. There was a lot of difficulties happening. You were the students that not only made it through your coursework, but you were involved in leadership opportunities and engagement opportunities. You got some valuable skills along the way. You'll take them with you no matter where you go and what you do. And I want to wish you luck in your next endeavor. Thank you. See you soon. Hello, everyone. I'm Emily Norton, Assistant Director of Engagement, Athletics, and Retention here at MCC. It's been a unique year for clubs and organizations. You've all worked hard connecting with your peers, putting in late nights, staring at screens, planning events, and much more. We want to thank you for that hard work, your determination, and everything you did. We know it wasn't easy and commend you for going above and beyond and continuing to be involved this year. We had 29 clubs active this year, two of which started up in the pandemic. 462 club members, 27 advisors, and 297 club meetings and events. You have been creative in the face of adversity and staying connected to your college and your fellow members. We truly see value in the work you do, the connections you made, and the contributions you make to the campus community. So thank you. We could not have clubs at MCC without the wonderful faculty and staff who serve as advisors. These amazing members of our community spend many hours volunteering their time working with our students. Collectively, they have mentored hundreds of students who are finding ways to connect and learn beyond the classroom. In the 2020-2021 academic year, they help students navigate the virtual world and host online events and meetings. They attended trainings and programs, reviewed forms, mediated conflict, celebrated successes, and made a huge difference in the students' lives. Thank you for all you do, Club Advisors. We will now recognize the Member of the Year Awards for clubs and organizations. Student leaders who receive this award are recognized for the leadership, dedication, and inspiration they provide to their club or organization. All club members will be receiving a small token of appreciation in the mail from the Office of Student Engagement. Acapella Club, Matthew Coleman and Abigail Coleman. African Culture Club, Tara Barlett. Bible Study Club, Maggie Montoya. Business and Economics Club, Tyler Galvin. Cyber Security Club, Mark Grim Grimshaw. Dental Assisting Club, Mallory Panay. Fans of Japan, Sabrina Lewis. Gamers Guild, David Eisenberg. ISPE MCC Student Chapter, Theta Morn. Latinos Unidos, Lorena Roderick. Mad Queens Club, Hannah Denise. Middlesex Activities Council, 
Lauren Norman. Model Aviation Club, Christian North. Any PBA, Audrey Cadu. Philosophy Club, Abigail Duffer. Running Club, Tim Burns. STEM Club, Tomas Rua. Student Government Association, Malaya Montgomery. Student Nurse Club, Michelle Lynn, Ashley D'Souza. Sustainability Club, Casey Winter. Women's Leadership Network, Bensu Bastapku. Congratulations to all the members of the year. The Student Club of the Year Award recognizes the outstanding student-run group which best exhibits student involvement, commitment to student life, and represents MCC well. The Office of Student Engagement is proud to announce the winner of the 2021 MCC Student Club of the Year Award to Model Aviation Club. We were excited to see Model Aviation have their first full year as a club. The pandemic didn't get in their way. They used the time at home to learn and grow the club and are ready to build fly and enjoy their time together when they are able to again. Congratulations, Model Aviation Club. Moving on to our student leaders. Our first recognition tonight is for our orientation leaders. Orientation leaders help ease the transition to Middlesex by offering support to new students in a variety of ways. These students work with instructors in the first year experience seminar to offer a component to the course which leads to strong positive relationships between new students and their peer role models while empowering students to help each other. They offer assistance to the instructor and to the student and serve as a resource for campus information. Please help me recognize the following students as all-stars orientation leaders this year. My name is Umar Flores and I'm here to recognize our Jumpstart participant this year. Jumpstart is a national early education organization working toward the day every child in America enters kindergartens prepared to succeed. We provide language literacy and social emotional programming for children from under resources communities and promote quality early learning experience for all children. This year we were able to serve all our communities completely virtually. Our members work hard to create virtual experience and activities for our kids during this difficult time. We are pleased and proud to recognize the following students. My name is Genevieve Morse and I am with the Career Development Office at Middlesex Community College. I have the honor of acknowledging three MCC uh, student employees that were nominated for the 2021 Student Employee of the Year Award. Um, student employees play an absolutely essential role 
at MCC, their leadership, hard work, and commitment to our student needs have been absolutely vital, especially during these difficult times. The student employee nominees were Ray Aganes, Julie Chamberlain, and Caleb Chin. I am also pleased to announce that Caleb was chosen as the Student Employee of the Year for the state of Massachusetts. Congratulations to Caleb, Ray, and Julie. We appreciate all that you do for your fellow students and for the College of the Hell as a whole. Thank you so much. I'm Shannon Carroll, Administrative Assistant for the Office of Student Engagement and Co-Advisor of the National Society of Leadership and Success. NSLS is an organization that provides leadership programming that helps students achieve personal growth and career success and empowers them to have a positive impact on their communities. These students have shown dedication to leadership by completing the basic requirements of the NSLS program, which includes attending an orientation and leadership training day, attending three leadership speaker broadcasts, and three success networking team meetings, where they developed individual goals to help prepare themselves as leaders on the road ahead. At Middlesex, students are invited to join when they've completed at least six credits at MCC and have a 2.75 GPA or higher. Please help me congratulate the following students who've been inducted to this honor society. Phi Theta Kappa recognizes the academic achievement of college students and provides opportunities for its members to grow with scholars and leaders. Established in 1918, Phi Theta Kappa has a presence on over 1,300 community college campuses in 11 nations. More than 3.5 million students have been inducted since 1918, with approximately 250,000 active members in the nation's community colleges, making Phi Theta Kappa a true catalyst among members and colleges. At Middlesex, students are invited to join PTK if they hold a 3.5 GPA or higher and at least 12 Middlesex credits, making this an even more of a prestigious achievement. Please help me congratulate the following students who have been inducted into Phi Theta Kappa Honor Society this year. The next group of Distinguished Student Leader Awards represent the top student leaders here at Middlesex Community College. The Student Spirit Award is presented to a student who demonstrates significant pride in Middlesex Community College. The student's support of MCC endeavors should be evident through their time commitment and encouragement of college initiatives. 
They must be a visible champion for MCC's mission, projects, and student body. I'm pleased to announce that Uyin Mai is a recipient of the Student Spirit Award. Uyin wears many hats on campus, including working as a Blackboard Ambassador, an SI Leader, Orientation Leader, and holding an executive position in the Asian Students in Alliance. Uyin's cross-campus involvement in MCC Pride is visible as we see here in marketing materials on MCC's website and social media. Uyin continues to foster her pride in our college community by continuing to commit time to co-curricular activities. Congratulations, Uyin! The Core Commitments Award is given to a student that displays the college's core commitment values of respecting diversity, striving for excellence, contributing to society, developing strong ethics, and acting with integrity. This award recognizes students whose actions exemplify these MCC values. Marissa Crew received the award this year as she has demonstrated many scholarly qualities during her time at the college. She is a member of Phi Theta Kappa Honor Society and will graduate this May with an exceptionally high GPA. Marissa has also worked as our Middlesex Food Pantry Assistant. In this role, she's taken the initiative to create resource guides for those who may be experiencing food and or housing insecurity. She's been recognized by department deans and chairs for her ability to support others to be as successful as she has demonstrated herself. Marissa clearly understands that pushing herself to excel now will lead to future success, and we wish her the best. Congratulations, Marissa. The Dorothy O'Connell Unsung Hero Award is given to a student in recognition to their unselfish devotion to MCC and their fellow students. The student must display a consistent willingness to lend a hand and has demonstrated readiness to act during a situation that requires action above and beyond the call of duty. The winner's contributions traditionally go unrecognized until this point. Our unsung hero this year is Ray Anthony's. Ray is currently employed in MCC's Academic Centers for Enrichment as both a peer tutor and supplemental instructor. According to his nominator, I recruited Ray first because of his reflective practice, calm and open demeanor, analytical approach to problem solving, and a linguistic awareness that I believe is the result of his habit of paying attention. For peer tutor monthly meetings, Ray provided training sessions for his other tutors in reflection and creating a welcoming, welcoming environment. Professor Quas had this to say about him. I would say that Ray is always looking to see what he can do for the students learning, both content-wise and mechanics of running the class. As an instructor, he is an excellent partner in the course. Congratulations, Ray. The 29 Who Shine Award is given to a graduating student who shows exceptional promise as a future leader in civic affairs or in business or professional activity, having already demonstrated their ability to contribute to the civic life and economic prosperity of the Commonwealth. The 29 Who Shine Initiative is part of a collective statewide effort to call attention to the pivotal role that higher education plays in producing a well-educated citizenry and workforce in the state of Massachusetts. Michaela Reinha is the recipient of the Massachusetts 29 Who's Shine Award. From performing COVID-19 tests on MCC's Bedford campus to administering vaccinations at LGH's site, Michaela has participated in historic learning opportunities and proven herself to be a valuable asset to our community. As a supplemental instructor and tutor of pharmacology, Michaela has enjoyed teaching and helping her classmates. A member of MCC's Honor Society Phi Theta Kappa, she's also participated in the Student Nurse Club where she's volunteered with the VA and run fundraisers for veterans. Michaela has been the student representative for the nursing program. In this role, she attends faculty meetings to be a liaison between students and professors. She's gained valuable leadership skills and honed her communication and confidence through this experience. After she graduates, Michaela wants to start working as soon as she can as a registered nurse in Massachusetts. She also plans to start her bachelor's degree and to go on and earn a master's in nursing education so she can one day become a professor to guide students like herself. Congratulations, Michaela. The James E. Houlihan Student of the Year Award, named in honor of Middlesex Community College's first president, is the highest student leadership award presented at the college. Students recognized with this honor exhibit strong leadership skills, solid character, and have an outstanding academic record. Caleb Chin is the recipient of the James E. Houlihan Student of the Year Award. His nominator writes, Caleb is among the finest examples of a champion. He is deeply committed to the students at Middlesex Community College and exhibits strong leadership skills, a solid character, 
and an outstanding academic record. Since his first semester in ACE, Caleb has worked with various professors as an SI leader, ranging from courses like Intro to Computer Science, Programming 1, Operating Systems and Basics, and most recently Programming 3. This past summer, Caleb was instrumental with our move to remote learning and tutoring due to COVID-19 and develop engaging supplemental materials for our online training. Caleb is a dual enrollment student leader that we can count on to facilitate and provide support to students while never jeopardizing his own coursework. Caleb is caring, compassionate, and his friendly demeanor help create a welcoming environment in our department. Caleb maintains a 4.0 GPA and has a demanding course schedule. He exhibits a maturity that belies his true age and is consistently willing to lend a hand whenever it is needed and regularly goes above and beyond. He is a professional, caring, and compassionate with, con with a keen spirit. He is a role model to his peers and everyone who has had the pleasure of working with him. Caleb is an innovative thinker who exceeds academically. Congratulations, Caleb. Congratulations again to all of our incredible students at MCC. You make this college such a great place to learn and grow. I thank you all for watching. If you haven't received your certificates or awards yet, you should be receiving them in the mail very soon. We've also sent out a small thank you box to all of our involved students as our way of saying thank you for an unusual but amazing year. And with that, we conclude this ceremony. We hope to see you all very soon. And in the meantime, be well.